But actually, you are low in an enzyme called ALDH2, and it's actually the enzyme that breaks down acetaldehyde, not the enzyme that breaks down alcohol. So let me explain. You turn red when you drink, not because of the alcohol, but because of this acetaldehyde step. So I don't know why God or nature or whatever designed human beings this way. But when we ingest alcohol, alcohol must convert into acetaldehyde before it converts into acetate, which is basically just non-toxic vinegar, and we pee it out. Now, it would be a whole lot more convenient if we could just go alcohol to acetate, but unfortunately we have this toxic step in the middle here called acetaldehyde. So it's kind of like you're allergic to alcohol, but not really because actually everyone is experiencing this. It's just that you experience it worse because you're low in this enzyme called ALDH2, which takes the acetaldehyde and breaks it down into acetate. So you can process the alcohol fine. The problem is the alcohol then builds up into this pool of acetaldehyde that's systemically affecting your body before it converts into this acetate. And that is just making you feel really bad. And that's actually happening to everyone, whether you turn red or not. Um, so I'm going to explain what you could actually do here in uh, something that would make you feel a lot better. So inside this product right here, Cheers Restore, there is an amino acid called L-cysteine. And L-cysteine can actually lower acetaldehyde levels. So if you take it at your last alcoholic beverage or before going to bed, that's typically when you have peak acetaldehyde levels. This is blood alcohol or blood acetaldehyde. They basically work together because of how fast alcohol metabolization is. You'll be at peak blood acetaldehyde levels here. And then if you take three Cheers Restore capsules, you'll see a lowering of these acetaldehyde levels. So let me explain what's actually happening. So L-cysteine will actually bind to acetaldehyde, both in the gut and in the bloodstream, and form a non-toxic compound called MTCA, uh, which you will then pee out. Uh, and so it doesn't actually get rid of the acetaldehyde, it just fuses to it and creates a biologically inert compound uh, that's non-toxic. Um, so this is a way that you can actually sidestep this acetaldehyde that's natural and it's actually good for you. And you can do it via this product right here called Cheers Restore. But Cheers Restore is also better because it has DHM, which can reduce this GABA rebound curve, which you can see explained in our top pinned video here on TikTok. It's also got other liver supporting ingredients as well as vitamins commonly lost during the alcohol metabolization process, and then a little bit of electrolytes. So if you're looking for a convenient solution to reduce those acetaldehyde levels so that you can feel better the day after drinking alcohol in such a way that's not bad for you, like pain relievers, then use Cheers Restore.